Hello mga boss, kumusta? Uh, ka currently, andito ako sa my um, EDSA um, Lugar nito ay Australia So, kung manggagaling kayo doon sa Ayala um, Magsakay ng bus For sure, uh, papunta sila rito Papuntang Guadalupe Tulay Okay? Kung galing naman doon Guadalupe Tulay Um, going to Ayala babalan din kayo sa Australia sa may overpass na yon. bakit ako nandito is uh, because lumabas na daw yung Honda Genio so na curious ako kung ano bang specs nito price kaya ako na, na parito sa Honda Edsa okay? so mamaya uh, sa, sa content na to maglagay na lang ako ng exact address ni Honda dito sa my EDSA actually this is a flagship uh, flagship dealer or masasabi natin main dealer ng mga Honda distributor so tara pasok tayo at tignan natin ang iba't ibang klaseng motor na ino-offer ni Honda okay kita nyo kumpara kay Yamaha Gravis naka ABS na yung harap Other, pero si Ginyo na wala pa siyang ABS pero si Gravis naman 1 to 5 kasi yun pero for sure kasi si Honda naman kahit wala siyang ABS yung braking power niya lalo na si rear ay malakas Tingnan natin yung price ni Junyo. Okay. 110cc. At naka LED na siya. For 72,000 hindi ka nalugi. Lalo pa kung gusto mo, kung nagsisimula ka magmotor. Lalo na sa babae. Kasi as they say, Genio 110 was built for ladies na gusto magsimulang magmotor. Yung bangko niya hindi siya ganun ka soft, hindi hindi rin siya ganun katigas. So ang maganda ang maganda nito kung uupo ka, hindi ka susubsob pababa at natatamaan mo yung baba niya. So hindi sasakit yung puwet mo kumpara dun sa malambot na na foam talaga maganda yung quality siya parang, parang hindi ka madudulas so hindi mo na kailangan magbili or magpalit na ito, leather ba to and pagdating sa lock nya so meron na din siya ignition lock for sure it's the same maganda rin yung panel so, And si Junyo ay meron enhanced smart power. For sure, this will save more gas. Kasi 110 lang siya. And ito yung food pegs. Steel na siya. Hindi siya yung or stainless steel. Hindi na siya yung parang rubber lang. Fuel injected. As you can see. Fuel injected na siya. So, 
for sure mati uh, mati pizza gas and currently guys nakaupo ako dito sa CVR 150cc Repsol pipe so ito yung meron na siyang passing light high beam pito and then signal light to the right and to the left somehow confusing siya kasi compare dati dito yung pito ngayon ginawa nilang mataas siguro for more para mabilis mo na lang mayabot pero at sa mga nakaka-confuse pa rin diba? and full digital na siya iba yung feeling kapag nakaupo ka dito kay CBR150 yung sabi nilang uh, sasakit yung likod mo mawawala yun eh pag feel mo yung bike ramdam yung bike mawawala yun promise so um 55 ako so hindi siya fully flood footed medyo nakatingkayan ako pero hindi naman masyadong tingkayan pero pwede na for daily commute 150cc matipid na to sa gas so replica to nung bike ni Mark Marquez kung kilala nyo siya isang um, rider din professional rider tsaka ang ganda ng ilang, ay, I mean yun uh, side mirror nya diba yan ito si CBR 150 Repsol Edition for complete features tignan natin doon so pakipost na lang ang video mga boss yan 2019 pa to na model mga boss $55,000 So may installment din sila dito So sadyain nyo na lang at magtanong sa mga sales representative Ito naman yung Honda Click 150 nila Tara tignan natin yung specs Maganda dito, keyless na siya. Keyless. Ito naman yung pressure niya. 98,900. Down payment and monthly. Panel gauge. Keyless. Flat board. Pero mga boss, hindi siya naka ABS. Pero po sure yung yung stopping power nito ay powerful. And ito pala yung ADV nila. X ADV. Wow. Wow, look at this machine. Comfy seat for long rides. Wow, digital, fully digital panel. Keyless. You should basta basta turn. Hangar. Wow. Chaka hindi siya chip na na button na. Alam mong mamahali ni. Look at this massive tire. Madilim kasi dito. Pasensya nyo na yung video. Madilim kasi dito sa loob. Nasa tabi talaga siya. With ABS. Wow. Tingnan natin yung specs niya mga boss.
for eight hundred five thousand. Malulugi ka pa ba dito sa ganda ng motor na to? Ganda ng mata. Disc brake pero dalawa. Dalawang disc brake. Walang ABS sa harap. And ito naman yung CBR 500 in a bright red color. Wow! Panganapin nyo dito. Fully digital. Pillion seat. Look at that exhaust. Massive machine. fully led light with ABS tignan natin yung spec Honda 500 CBR worth 413,000 and meron din sila dito CV650 ganda wow Underbelly exhaust, comfy seat, fully digital. Wow, ano pa nga napin yung complete package nisha. Kento. Oh, yung machine na. Hindi siya klaro. Lucky. Sobra. And may mga kapatid to. Gusto niya tingnan? Pum! Ang dami nila. God. God. Worth five hundred one thousand. Ndami kang pagpipilian. Pwede ka mamili pero isa lang. Isa lang ang dapat mong mahal. Ano daw? Kanda. Specs ni Honda CV six hundred fifty R. Is this an R or just six hundred? Yeah, six hundred fifty R. So, mga boss, just pause the video. Thank you. May two-channel ABS na siya. For 501,000. Dapat lang, lakas ang motor nito eh. Oh, ayan mga boss. I am currently riding at Honda CV1. I mean, 650R worth 501,000. So, kaya naman for 5.5 na height, fully digital. As you can see, fully digital. Medyo, hindi lang nga lang siya keyless. Pero, yeah, if you are looking for power and acceleration, you might consider buying this one. For 5.5 na height, tignan nyo. 
uh, medyo nakatingkayad na ako pero manageable naman sa mga traffic na siksikan and I think this is an adjustable pwede mo nyo siya ipababa kung gusto nyo ba diba? wow may passing light high beam and low beam yung pito nya left and right signal kill switch ay sobrang lambot ng 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 clutch oh as you can see with two channel ABS massive tank wow if only I could purchase this one why not but yeah let's work hard for this and for those of you who are interested for this type of bike I think this is for touring um, just comment down below uh, this is the Revel 500 Um, they didn't include the specification of this bike but if you are interested please come and visit their dealership their dealer here at Ed's uh, Australia let me hop on on this bike okay wow um, sitting wise this is quite comfortable just look look at my foot it's fully flattened so no issue if you are less than five and uh, this bike is fully digital so high beam yung pito left and right the kill switch so fully digital high beam indicator left and right indicator neutral engine check oil check temperature and ABS whoa this bike has an ABS amazing this is the Revel 500 you can visit them here and they have different colors black and I don't know what color is this please just comment down below it's amazing ABS disc brake wow magnificent and they have this touring slash sport bike African twin look at that massive eyes it's really inviting you to bring him outside or to bring her outside and experience the speed that she can offer okay fully digital wow amazing wow fully digital and they have this ABS so you can engage and disengage the ABS Mm -hmm. Okay, fantastic. And yeah, for sure, high beam, low beam, and I'm sure you can set this bike on what do you call this? I forget. I really forget. I'm sure this bike has traction control modes, select, uh, what do you call this? Park warning the pito left and right the kill switch kill switch on and i mean kill switch on start so yeah if you are type of person who loves touring then this bike is for you come and take it Bring it home, dude. Mga boss, bring it home. Do all this break with ABS. Let's see the specification. Yes. Specification. For 860,000 in peso, you can't go wrong with this bike. 
that's for sure. And they have different colors in red and in blue. African twin. Wow, massive, massive engine. And guys, if you want to test ride, just kindly ask the permission because they have it here. So, as you can see, medyo slippery lang kasi si Bagyong Pisoy na meron na naman dito sa Manila. Ito yung test ride nila. Um, sa side lang to ni Honda. Dito sa Mayedsa. Ang pinapa-test drive nila for um, Honda Beat 110 um, Honda XRM125 Honda Click I'm sure this one is 150 pero meron din silang 1 to 5 sa loob so pwede nyo i-ask kung gusto nyo test drive before purchasing the bike I think it would be better kung ma-test ride muna bago natin uh, bilhin so that we can you know feel the bike kung gusto ba natin or hindi if this is the bike for you at least as a consumer we have the choice the choices ba importante kasi yun kasi syempre if you're gonna purchase the bike it's gonna be it's gonna be with you forever or unless kung ibebenta mo siya kasama mo yan uh, within your family as daily commute you know? so you, you should considering you should consider uh, test riding the bike before purchasing okay okay mga boss sige mukhang gandito na lang muna ako and mag upload pa ako ng iba thank you you have a great day bye for now